Hey everyone, so today we are here at Tarpon Springs. Uh, it was about almost two hours uh, away from our house. Uh, supposedly this town is, um, is one of the uh, Greek towns. So actually before this morning, we've uh, never even heard of Tarpon Springs before, but it looked like a really cool place to visit, and it definitely is. It's kind of like a hidden gem of Florida. So you should definitely come visit here if you have the chance. Here we have Greek imports, Greek music. And yeah, actually as you're walking around the downtown area of Tarpon Springs, you can hear Greek music. It's um, very relaxing. I've never heard Greek music before. This town is definitely very unique. Here we have the names of the street um, in Greek and in English. Definitely a Greek town. So a really cool fact about um, Tarpon Springs is that it actually has the largest Greek population in all of the U.S. Over here we have the sponge factory, Spongeorama, free exhibit center where you can see um, sponge that they get from the ocean. So in front of the Spongeorama Museum is a big sign uh, talking about the history of Tarpon Springs and how it became the largest sponge industry in the entire world. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I never knew that sponges, um, traditional sponges that we use came from here. It's definitely very empty for a Sunday afternoon as we are filming this, um, but it's different. Um, I love that it's uh, so relaxing and so peaceful here. Um, it's really nice to get away from the crowds at the theme parks. Here we can see a uh, real sponge <laughs> that they um, got from the ocean. At the Sponge, sponge Diver Supply Store. Uh, it, does, it is open. Um, it did look closed. Okay, so I couldn't uh, not take a picture of this. Um, so this store has actually used their sponges to make a cute little smiley face on their on their building so yeah definitely um very cool to see yeah so here's a whole uh, a whole bin of real sponges that you guys can um touch them and uh hold them also about four dollars multi-purpose got a really large yellow sponges down there yeah they feel actually just like the ones we buy in the store they got special uh, facial silk sponges. Yeah, these ones are a bit softer. Now we are inside a shop that sells a whole assortment of sponges. Um, they also sell a lot of uh, bars of soap and also um, bath bombs. Definitely a lot of things uh, for everyday use. Definitely a very unique store. I've never uh, seen a store like this before. For the best part of our trip to Tarpon Springs, um, 
going to the Greek town wouldn't be complete without seeing some, seeing some of the food they have to offer, in particular desserts. So there's a few um, supposedly famous um, bakeries around here, um, and uh, we're going to check them out. Yeah, everything looks really nice. Um, everything looks so delicious. Um, a bit expensive, but uh, we're probably going to get something here um, before the day is over. Here we actually have some uh, traditional Greek pastries, see baklava, and some other um, Greek desserts here. Some other, some other uh, sweets are also here. Some breads. Oh, he brought you a tray. Jonathan bought these. Yeah, the cakes look so good. Um, we decided to get a lemon cake from one of the bakeries. Um, it says it's supposed to have lemon custard inside and some whipped cream. Um, yeah, it should be a lemon flavored cake. It looks really good. getting ready to leave Tarpon Springs. Um, it was a really nice day here. It was definitely a very unique town, very authentic. A lot of Greek restaurants and Greek music everywhere. Um, we also heard people speaking Greek at the restaurants. Um, yeah, so lemon cake we had. Um, it was all right. A little heavy. Um, a bit too much cream inside, but the uh, lemon, the lemon custard part on top was really nice. Um, kind of expensive, $5.50 per cake, but it was huge. Uh, we did have to split it. Definitely couldn't eat it on my own. So um, yeah, I guess 550 wasn't really too expensive since it was huge. Um, so yeah, uh, thank you everyone for watching and see you guys next week. Bye!